little boys and girls from Little Tree House. It's Teacher QP and Lana. And today we carry on with our Sandy Sunfish story. Today is Wednesday. Let's listen to our song and our sound and we carry on with our story of Sandy Sunfish. Sunfish reads... Well done. Let us start our story. Swish, swish, splash, splash. Sandy Sunfish was going to eat supper at Shirley Shrimp's house. They swam down in the deep sea. Suddenly, Sandy Sunfish saw many, many fish. Short fish, long fish, blue fish, green fish. Fish with little eyes and little noses. Fish with bigger eyes and bigger noses. There were many, many fish in that part of the sea. Where do all these fish live? Thought Sandy Sunfish. Swish, swish. Sandy Sunfish followed Shirley Shrimp to the old, old ship. The old, old ship lay in the sand on the deep sea. The old, old sunken ship lay stretched out on the smooth ocean sand. Many fish could swim around and around in the old ship. The ship was very big. It was bigger than a car. The old, old ship was bigger than a truck. The old, old ship was very, very big. The old ship had windows that were like circles. The windows were as round as balloons. Pretty curtains hang in the old, old ship's windows. Green seaweed grew in front of the old, old ship's floor. The green seaweed was long and stringy. Clang, clang! Someone was ringing the bell hanging by the old, old ship's door. Time for supper! Sandy Sunfish looked around. Who said time for supper? Swish, swish! Short fish, long fish, blue fish, green fish. All the fish started swimming to the old, old ship. Some fish were smiling. Some fish were singing. All the fish were happy. Sandy Sunfish and Shirley Shrimp quickly followed the happy fish swimming into the old, old ship. It looked like fun. Inside the old, old ship was a long, long table. On the long, long table, table were small bowls and big bowls. Beside each brass bowl was a shiny glass and a silver spoon. There were small wooden stools in front of the bowls. Short fish, long fish, blue fish, green fish, all the fish swam to their small wooden stools. Sandy sunfish could see the bowls were filled with tasty seaweed soup. Mmm, Sandy sunfish could smell that tasty seaweed soup. Sandy sunfish swished her fins happily. Suddenly she was very, very hungry. Sandy Sunfish looked at all the fish sitting at the long, long table. She looked at short fish, long fish, blue fish and green fish. I would like to eat with all these fish, thought Sandy Sunfish. It would be such fun. Sandy Sunfish looked at the table again. She looked at short fish, long fish, blue fish and green fish. Would there be room at this long, long table for Sandy Sunfish? Where would Sandy Sunfish sit? <gasps> Boys and girls, do you think they're going to make space for Sandy Sunfish at this long table? Yes. I think they will. If they are kind like our little treehouse boys and girls, I'm sure they will. Do you guys want to answer some questions about Sandy Sunfish? Yes. Okay, listen carefully. Sandy Sunfish was going to eat supper with... Shirley, Shirley Shrimp. Shrimp. What did Sandy Sunfish see lying at the bottom of the sand? A broken ship. An old, old ship. Was the old ship a small ship or a big ship? A big ship. Bigger than a? Truck and a car. And a car. What were the windows on the old, old ship uh, like? What were they? Like a circle. 
like a circle. Good job. What kind of soup were the fish having? Hmm. Uh, seaweed. Seaweed soup. Yay. Okay, so tomorrow we listen to the rest of the story. So I hope you come back. Big hugs and kisses to all of you. See you tomorrow. Bye.